Hey guys, this is Lucretia and welcome in the room. You've tuned in to another episode of Candid Conversations. Thank you so much for joining in with me today. And today's candid topic is going to be about debt. Who has debt today? Well, I'm going to take it from a different angle. Hebrews 10, 16 through 17 reads as follows. This is the new covenant I will make with my people on that day, says the Lord. I will put my laws in their heart and I will write them in their mind. Then he says, I will never again remember their sins or lawless deeds. That's right. The debt has been forgiven in Jesus Christ. When we accept Jesus into our hearts as our Lord and our Savior, he does not remember our sins anymore. He is not knocking us over our head every single day, bringing up all of the wrong things that we have done. That is pretty heavy. Have you ever gotten a call from a debt collector? Well, that's pretty heavy. We owed a huge debt. A debt is an outstanding balance that we absolutely owe and we're supposed to pay. But Jesus has forgiven the debt of sin. We are not halfway free, but totally free. Jesus offers complete freedom and forgiveness of our sins. That is wonderful news. The law did not have the power to set us free, keeping lots of rules and regulations and the Ten Commandments and all of those things. Great, but they did not have the power to set us free upholding a bunch of rules and regulations, it doesn't make us free. God invites us to share into a new covenant in order to experience freedom from sin. Sin produces heaviness. However, the guilt and the shame has been eradicated in Jesus Christ. What is keeping you? from totally living free in Christ today. Sometimes life can be difficult. And freedom in Christ, it may seem like a difficult concept to grasp, especially in a world where we make plenty of mistakes. And when I reflect upon all of the mistakes that I have made, if I stay there, then it makes me feel totally condemned. But I have to go back to the word of God and see what it means to live free in Christ and realize that he paid the price. He paid my debt for me. Our freedom is not a badge to live any kind of way that we want, but it's an opportunity to share in a life with Jesus Christ, to go on a journey with Jesus and know that we have been forgiven for our sins. The light of his word will lead the way. Thank God that I am dead free. I no longer have to pay the penalty or the price for my sins because Jesus paid it all. Let us pray. Father, thank you for your word. Your word is so rich as usual. Thank you for putting your laws, your word, your spirit in my heart and in my mind. And thank you so much for the new covenant. Thank you for your faithfulness to forgive me for all of my sins and not to remember them anymore. I love you. I am so grateful for your love. Your love lights my path to freedom. Repeat after me. 
I am forgiven in Christ. I am under a new covenant. I no longer owe a debt to sin. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Candid Conversations. And remember, the debt has been forgiven. Goodbye. <laughs>